Hey, this is Jessie from Beta Stash. In this video, I'm going to be taking you through two basic taping techniques, the closed loop and the figure of eight or the X system. These can be used if you have injured a pulley and you want some extra support or when you're getting back into climbing again and you want that feedback. The pulleys are bands of connective tissue that link the flexor tendon that comes from your forearm into the finger. It holds it against the bone um, and you have five of them, A1, A2, A3, A4 and A5. We're going to be covering these middle ones, A2 to A4 in this video, with the taping that we are using to support those and give them more strength. There are a lot of different taping techniques out there. I personally prefer the single loop because it's quick and easy to apply. Um, or the figure of eight because it offers a lot more support. It does take a little bit of getting used to though because it can restrict your movement. Um, there's a lot of research supporting the edge tape technique as well, so just try them all out and find out what works best for you. I use rigid tape um, as opposed to the flexible tape because I feel like it gives more support, um, but you do need to bear in mind that the rigid tape can cut off blood flow if you're gonna make it too tight. Um, so a way to prevent that happening is to actually remove the pieces to the length that you want before you start applying it to your hand. Um, if you get a thicker uh, tape like this, then you just cut it into thinner strips of about 8 to 10 mil. Um, you can also buy them in that width already. Okay, so now we're going to tear ourselves a piece of tape. Okay, and I'm going to put it over the A2 pulley. And you don't need to do it super tight. And uh, once you've finished with this one, it's quite a good one, but it puts a lot more pressure on the later pulleys. So I like to do a second one. Over on this area. If you, um, if you have chalk on your hands, you might just want to rinse those off because it makes the glue struggle a little bit. Um, and then when you're done, just press your finger to see how long it takes for the white to go away. If it goes away in two seconds, then you're good to go. Um, my fingers are just a little bit pink from climbing. For the second one, you want to wrap um, the tape around twice. And then from there, you go up into the X position. You don't need to do a type because the shape of the um, taping itself is going to um, give the support that you need. And then keep your finger flexed at 30 um, because otherwise it just makes it too restrictive. Okay, so there you have it, two different taping techniques for pulley injuries, the single closed loop and the figure of eight or the X taping technique. Remember, pulley injuries take a lot longer to heal than you might think, so make sure you consult a professional to speed up recovery, manage pain, and prevent recurrence. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more. If you have any questions about taping, leave a comment below. Cheers and see you soon.